baby So, man, where do I even start? So, uh, when we landed. When we landed, wow. We went to customs. We went through customs. Went through customs. That was a that was a process. <laughs> it was cool though. We got our first real stamp yep. with our passport. It felt mega legit. That was dope. That was super dope. The camera's right here. So. Uh, yeah. <laughs> She's. She, she putting me on. I'm, I'm new to this. You're looking the wrong way. Um, so that was cool. And then I feel kind of lame because we, uh, there was a, a door that where you can exchange your money for police money. And we didn't know what we were supposed to do. <laughs> we're like, uh, do we need to do this? Is this a requirement? But there was an ATM. And when you put your ATM, uh, your card in there, it converts American dollars into police money. So that was pretty cool, I thought. And then when we walked out the door, there were all these people holding signs um, for people that are picking up and just crowded around the door. Daniel said he felt like Beyonce. I said a celebrity. <laughs> <laughs> um, but that was kind of cool. And uh, we called the resort and turns out that they did not have a taxi service. And we actually had to get on a ferry to get over to the island of like, San Pedro. All this staying. stuff was all this stuff was so new to me. I like I'm like, wait, we didn't okay. Do our research at all. Okay, we're wait. So we're going to Belize. So we we got here to Belize and you know, you you in a new place. You hop off the airplane and you get your bags and the next thing you do is to get a cab to or the hotel shuttle. or a shuttle to the like hotel, hotel, right? Shuttle. No. <laughs> here in Belize, we're on we're on we're on yeah, you get a cab. But we're on San San Pedro, uh -huh, San so which is an island. Mm -hmm. So you had to get a, a cab to the ferry, or to a flight. Uh, like they do like a little smaller a little mini flight. They'll fly you over. So we got to the ferry. So we had to get on the boat. Yep. We were on the boat, yep. take us over to the island for an, another hour and a half on the boat. Yep. Uh, we, didn't, we didn't have no food. Cause which wasn't which we wouldn't were have been too bad. And we were starving. It would have been too bad if we weren't so hungry. Oh my gosh. So. Baby. Uh, so yeah, now we're finally here when you get off the boat though. Oh, oh wait, before you get there, we found out on our first taxi that it's like seven, no not seven, ten dollars for regular fuel. Here. To get gas. Yeah, so convert that to U.S. dollars, it's like, it's like five or six dollars a gallon. A gallon. Regular. For, for regular unleaded. Not That's even, not even premium. Look, look, crazy. look, I would never complain about gas prices in Texas again. Most people walk and have bikes here because it's, that's crazy. Like, that's crazy. But anyway. But yeah. Our second cab, when we got off, when we got off the ferry. I know, I'm just trying to wave the little buddies away. Uh, second cab. Was a go-kart. Oh, no, it was. Yes. Margarita, please. On the rocks? Frozen. Frozen. Salt in the rim? Yes, please. <laughs> Look at her. She is like, I'm she ready. is here, I'm ready. and then she is like getting straight with it. Like, but, I gotta eat first. I'm not eating. <laughs> <laughs> the second cab yeah. is a go kart because the island is full of go karts, which is kind of cool and unique. Except I felt I feared a little bit for my life because there was people everywhere, and they would just walk out into the street. Like they would just come over in the left or come up, come off on you from the right. Yeah, man. I mean, like it's just like. You'll be driving, and then somebody will dart out on a bike or, or walking or in a golf cart, and then you gotta come to an abrupt stop. And it was, was a couple times. You can tell. You can tell he was good at you know what he what he does because the uh, there was there was some there was some points where I was just like, look, man, I I'm not even gonna try and rent anything to drive around. Yeah, here cause because you can rent a go kart for the day for fifty dollars. Yeah, and I'm just like, look, I'll end up hitting one of the pedestrians <laughs> and. And you know, it might be a whole thing. I don't know. I don't. I feel like people maybe get hit around here often. That probably happens. People get hit around here pretty often, man. 
Yeah. 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 People get bumped while they're walking out here pretty often. What do you mean like bumped? Like bumped. Yeah. Well, not often. Not often? Unless if they're drinking. <laughs> Let me stay yeah. right here. Bicycles in there. are more dangerous, actually. Really? Yeah. The bikes? Oh, really? Yes. Um, actually, there was a time where we were driving, we were coming, and uh, and uh, our our driver was on the left side of the street, and a guy kind of like got his bike and he just kind of swung it around. He did, and almost like hit, almost yeah. hit. And it hit. Yeah. Wow. wow. Especially if they're drunk. While they're riding their bike, right? Sometimes they will just like you know when they're riding yeah, and just drift off in the suite. Oh car my gosh! And when they see the car coming, they go like this, and then you're in front of them. And oh like, my god! That's yeah. terrible. But, yeah. So, yeah, that was the second experience. <laughs> and then uh, when we got here, man, we were just so amazed um, with how the grounds looked. Beautiful. Um, it's really gorgeous out here. And uh, we got to our cabana, uh, opened the door, and, and, and Nay's jaw automatically dropped. She's mm-hmm. like, it's so, so, so gorgeous it's in so here. It's so cute. It's so cute. It's yeah. so cozy. It feels like you're at someone's home, for real. And there's little seats on the outside. You can come out, to watch the sunset. Um, we're out of the regular triple sec. Okay. I can do a blue margarita, which is gonna be the same, just the color is gonna be blue. Let's do a blue, azul. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, and got the you know the, the scenery going on. They got the beach. They got the dock. They have this feature at this restaurant. It's really cool. If you catch a fish, they'll cook it for you. That is so neat. I've never, well, I've been at many places, but I've never. Yeah, we got to travel around. Before. This is probably the normal. This is probably right. the normal, and we are just now hip to it. Right. We don't know about it, so we don't. Uh, we are starting to get out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But first day, we're gonna wrap it up with dinner, and then we're gonna go back to the room and probably fall and make out. Oh, man. We're so tired, man. but so happy. It's still kind of surreal that we're here. Like I don't think it really hit me. But it probably will tomorrow when we go exploring um, in the city. So, oh, there's so much we're going to do this week. Like, I cannot wait. <laughs> That's good, babe. Doesn't it? Wow. This is plantains. So this is like a banana kind of... Uh, fruit okay. that they fry up. Okay. Rice and beans, coleslaw, and this is chicken stew. This is authentic Moroccan. Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. Oh yeah. This is my Out of our cabana, and this guy is just sitting here chilling. This is our cabana, and this is him. <laughs> so, y'all about that life? Or what? No, sir, we are not about that life. Sorry, sorry, just disturbing you. Hey, y'all probably can't hear that. They probably can. We are in freaking Belize and it ain't over as plain. Like, this mm. made my entire day. Dang, mm. Lenny. Mm-hmm. Maybe we're gonna relocate upstairs, boy. Uh, 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 upstairs <laughs> where? <laughs> what are you talking about? Upstairs. They want you, you know, you can sit up there. Oh, is that where the music's coming from? Yeah, I imagine. Wait for the chorus. Check it out. The hidden treasure. without to 
technology for the most part. It's kind of rough. They've been rough for me. It's <laughs> you said it's been rough, babe? Mm -hmm. It's rough for me. Why? I'll be on my phone. I'll be, I'll be trying to post a Snapchat. Can't do it. <laughs> it forces you to be uh, resourceful. Like, you have to use your eyes. You have to use your ears. You have to talk to people. You have to talk to people. <laughs> You are forced to talk to people. But ain't no, like, nice. ain't none of this, like, room full of people when you like this. Nope. It's either you like this, you're in the room looking awkward, or you're talking to people and learning about them. And, you know, everybody's over here been, it's been pretty nice, though. You don't even feel like withdrawals, do you? Or do you? A little. <laughs> A little when I'm in the room, you know, and it's just, you know, we just we ain't doing nothing in there. That's, that'd be the times where I really want to be on my phone doing something. Have you been bored though? I haven't been bored, no. I haven't had a chance to be bored yet. Right. I'm very excited because I want to go um, to the beach just by the cabana later when we have some quiet time. Um, and I want to read the book. I downloaded Becoming Michelle Obama by Michelle Obama. And I started reading it on the flight yesterday and it is so good. So I can't wait to jump back into it. But it's going to be so cool just be on the beach, get the nice breeze and relax. I'm looking forward to that later. Uh, Daniel wants to go back to the bar and get drinks, so we're definitely going to do that <laughs> also. That's another cool thing about Belize. There's um, a lot of dogs and cats, but unlike, unlike in America where they're stuck in a house or they're stuck in a yard, they uh, roam around free here, but they still have families that they you know, go back home to. <laughs> hey, buddy. Hey. You come over here and see what we do. He's like, nah, you good. Hey, buddy. <laughs> He's thinking about it. <laughs> what do you got, babe? What you ordered? The pasta? You excited, babe? So hungry. Crazy. I think I might taste it. Right here. Funny thing about it is I wrote another song for you This is just the way that everything came out I wanna tell you things like I love you and I'm crazy for you Sorry for the times that I left you stressed out I love you, babe. I love you, babe. From New York to LA Right here. Funny thing about it is I wrote another song. It smells good. Like I can smell all the tomatoes and everything. Yeah. The lime was good too. Alright, so where we start? Just take a chip. Just dig in there. Take a chip. Um, make sure you get some of the meat, the white meat. Meat. Okay. Yeah. Mix it with the onions and everything. So get more, get all the toppings. Yeah, more, more than that. Yeah. Like, make sure flavor is in Alright, so that's good. Ooh, so, yeah. Like it? It's not bad. Not bad. What's it taste like? It's not bad, not here. <laughs> oh. Everything in here? He usually doesn't eat. Like <laughs> the onion. I'll eat the onion on a burger or something like that. Yeah. Wow, Daniel. That's actually pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My bad. It is good. <laughs> it's fresh. Yeah. It's got a fresh taste to it. Now you like your food um, salted and <laughs> seasoned with artificial flavor. And this is fresh, real food. Mm. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Right here. Hey guys, it's hey. uh, it's the next morning. Yeah. Uh, we woke up really late. Um, probably yeah. because we went to bed really late. Like really late. So yeah, I'm just uh, a little bit uh, 
bummed because we were getting a late, such a late start, but it still should be a good day. Um, so, yeah, our, our guy's going to pick us up from the ferry dock, take us to the zoo, and whatever else we want to do. Right here. So we're in our second cab on our way to the Blue Zoo, and our cab driver, Lloyd, is so cool. We're going to get to go to his house and meet his family. We're going to go to a restaurant that he's going to recommend. And now he's buying us a coconut so we can try authentic Belizean coconut water. Now, me and Dale tried coconut water before, and we didn't like it, right, there. Yeah, it was the, uh, yeah, the, what is it, the Vita or Vita? Yeah, like Vita water. Yeah, or whatever like that. that was. It was disgusting. It was gross. It was so nasty. So we're so, kind of nervous. I'm hoping this, the actual, you know, the real deal, all, out of the actual coconut, uh, you know, is better. So <laughs> we'll see. This, this is the water. Okay. okay. The straw. The I actual coconut water. Coconut water. Oh, this they put is it the up. meat. Okay. Meat. You're going to eat this. This is going to fool you. You don't even want to eat something else. <laughs> <Okay>. What? <laughs> this is things like this that we survive in our jungles with. Wow. Right. We're hungry. We see coconut trees go wild here. Yeah. Wow. Drink the water, eat the meat out of it. It keeps you up. Oh, this is nothing like the, this is the stuff we like had. No. In the What's US, it like? this is not nothing like that. What does it taste like? It's sweet. It's sweet? Yeah. It's like fruit juice. Yeah. What? It's natural. This is survival here. Right. It is. It's like a... a I mean, it is a fruit juice. But it is a fruit juice, yeah. It's not like the store is at all. No, man. That's the one in the store that says it's artificial flavor. That's mm -hmm. what exactly what it is. This is natural. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's sweet, but not like super duper sweet. Just trying this to try it. Looks like. Yeah. It's different. I don't think I've tasted anything like that. Um, it does have the mild flavor. It's pretty good. I've seen her here before, baddest ever seen. Way that she walks, she should be on TV. Like she trying to, trying to make a movie. Like she want to make a movie.
seen her here before Baddest ever seen Way that she walks She should be on TV Like she trying to make a movie Trying to make a movie Like she wanna make a movie Wanna make a movie Let's go So pretty, she got big dreams headed for the big city. She got everything in the case that we're fitting. She got optimism in the whole lot of ambition. What a little brave bird, about to spread a grown wing. She got imagination, so she don't need a thing with no hesitation. She quick to share a dream with no time wasted. She's giving everything. With the 20 auditions and a bunch of will call you's. Start believing that her dreams are too far to rise up. But the negative and the small do To other birds whose dreams got lost She too. can hear a mama voice saying Girl, see, I told you Nobody wants to take a chance on you It's easier to give up than it is to continue But what you gotta know is Even mountains must bend to a tree my love. It don't matter how long All that matters is you choose to believe her Believe her, believe her. If I don't listen to y'all Cause if everybody fails Then who can make it at all And if everybody's isn't What's to frame my disposition Then I wouldn't have made this record And you probably wouldn't listen to it You say you got a dream We'll do it Cause you can do anything No regrets You were born for the moment Fears you're upon them But remember it Don't want it from a dream no matter how long, all that matters is you choose to believe her. Believe her. Believe her. You can run a marathon.
hitting walls and you wanna give up. I know it seems it's not enough. You take a step forward, but you still feel stuck. I know it seems it's not enough. You're tired of hitting walls and you wanna give up. Dipping the straw. <laughs> Don't worry about how I'm stirring. Um, hmm. You need some stirring lessons. <laughs> <laughs> I think I do too. Yeah, I'm trying not to spill it because I want all of it, like every last drop. <laughs> <laughs> Drink the top down. <laughs> 